I told you I'd tell you something special about Hanneman here. And it, it really is kind of special. And uh, is this what you're doing for them tonight, too? Oh, a little something bit extra, like too, just for them. Okay, good. Uh, yeah, because they're kind of special. Hanneman just got back uh, two weeks ago, or well, last week, actually. Last week, yeah. Last week, he was in Michigan performing for a whole bunch of magicians at the Abbott's Magic Convention as a contestant. And it's kind of neat. Not a lot of magicians can do this, but very impressive. Henneman here took second place in the contest. Yay. Yeah. Yay. And this is against really good magicians. So uh, definitely give him a little extra special <laughs> hand. Congratulations, Henneman. Uh, we, we, we certainly here think it's special because he's part of our theater. So thanks a lot. Henneman, they're all yours. A deck of cards, a tool of the magician, and the card sheet. Miss, I'm going to call upon you in a moment. You can stay seated. Uh, I'm going to be looking away, but what I want you to see is that all the cards are different. Give them a little extra shuffle here. Miss, I'm going to go down the side of the deck here. And what I'd like you to do is tell me stop at any time. <laughs> Would you like me to go further or? No. Perfect. Okay, so what I'd like you to do is remember your card. Mm -hmm. A little bit of backup. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, I'm a magician, not a card cheat. So what I'd like you to do is find your card in the deck. You just, could just go through those quickly. And almost halfway through the deck. Two-thirds of the way through the deck. It's like something strange is going to occur. Like maybe your card isn't there. No, <laughs> That's strange. Well, I told you I'm a magician, not a card sheet, so maybe I should just stick to magic here and show you a little magic trick. Um, let's do this. Four cards. From the front, I think we all can agree these cards look very different from one another. But from the back, they very much look the same. And if I go like this, you almost imagine there's more than four cards, but there's one, two, three, and four cards. Wait, one, two, three, four cards. One, two, three, four cards. That's quite impossible. There can't be. Well, that just leaves us with your card, the Joker. Oh, of course not, because it's the Ten of Clubs. Oh. Wow. No, thankfully, I'm, I'm a magician, not a card sheet. You know, a little fortune might have just changed hands. Friends, you've been a fantastic audience tonight, but I believe I've saved the best for last. We've experimented with the handkerchief, the coin but not the rope. <laughs> I was really hoping that would... Well, you see that? I think we have an opportunity here. This rope might be magical. George, was it? Yep. George, would you mind helping me just one more time? Uh, we may have an opportunity with this magic rope to do something that, well, that maybe only Danny could have done. And I, I can't pass up the chance here. So, what I'd like you to do, I just did a simple knot. George, you want to grab the top? I want you to pull that as tight as you can across my hands. Tight. Okay? And then, um, as you're doing that, we're going to take this one right here, and I want you to sort of wrap it between my hands, like between them. Yeah. Yep. Um, up through the middle if you can. That'll work. Yep. I'm going to pull it very tight. Like, no mercy here. There you go. Good. 
Okay, now the other one, if you could pass it the other way between my hands, uh, between them though, to sort of lock this up. Okay, and if you could try to tie the ends together. Uh, and if you want to, here, let's, before you do that, if we could, could, we just pass, instead of having that go around the side, can you have it go in the middle, please? This one? This one, right? <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, if you could undo that last knot. It's a magic rope, but I'm not sure how magical it's going to be. Okay, let's try this. If you could pass it, this one under my, this one under my arm. And then tie them together. Thank you, Thompson. Because now you see how this sort of keeps them separate. Mm -hmm. Now you can tie it very tight. <laughs> Thank you, George. Mm -hmm. You return to your seat. <laughs> That's strange. I really thought this was a magic rule. Mm -hmm. I might need a little favor here. Can you untie that knot? George, I was really hoping I could pull a Danny here, but this rope isn't as magical as I thought it was, or maybe not. Let's try something else. So, what might be better than one magic rope? What's better than one? Two. Two, mm. Two magic three. ropes, or maybe three. <laughs> Well, for that we need extremely sharp whoa muffin. Okay. <laughs> There's no scissors. <laughs> what a silly fish. Wait. I just cut that rope. Hey, yeah, this time we need to get some evidence. This rope get off look that easy. <sighs> yeah, this rope is magical after all. I just have to learn to make it uh, do some magical escapes like Danny. Hmm. Well, I wonder if we could tie the ends together. I mean, it, I couldn't escape. I need to, like, so maybe if we tie the ends together, this rope is going to stay out of trouble. Hmm. The fish keeps looking at that banana. How many snack on these instead, Muffin? And stay away from that banana. Hmm. I mean, it's not. I, I was really hoping it would vanish. I, I'm not sure. Hmm. It's on there pretty good. Tell me I just had to slide my hands to the side and the rope would have came right off? Oh wait, no. I wonder if that would go back to the middle. <laughs> For that hook line and sinker. <laughs> hmm. I think this rope is trying to trick me. Well, maybe, maybe we should cut it into more pieces. Two? it even more. Eight pieces of rope. Eight minus one equals seven. Seven minus one equals six. Six minus one equals five. Wow, this rope is really confusing and incredible. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you so much for letting me share that with you.
on behalf of myself, uh, everybody, and of course, Muff, Muffin ate the banana. Well, men need a real big round of applause for Banana Muffin. Oh, my God. Oh. Thank you.